Senior police officials appeared Wednesday on Mayor McCarthy's Waltham Update show to talk about a recent rash of crime in the city. Well, overall crime is up. <clears throat> uh, it's not up in all categories. Uh, categories that it has gone up is uh, domestic violence, uh, trespassing, uh, shoplifting. Most of these, these crimes are definitely related to the economy today. We've got uh, the police department has handled over 34,000 calls to date. This year? This year. They average about 45,000 a year. Um, arrests this year are up over 1,000 already. Um, summonses to court um, were over, uh, over 300 Waltham residents. This masked robber hit the New World gas station on Main Street last Thursday. With the help of this woman and a friend of hers, police captured the man who had fled on bike with a change of clothes. But police say that Thomas Nolan, the 50-year-old Cambridge man they apprehended, is not linked to a series of other holdups of small stores on Main, Moody and River Streets, also by a masked man in dark clothing. There's been five recent robberies, the New World and four others. We do not believe that the New World gas station robbery is connected to the other four. Starting on October 26, the masked robber hit the Bank Square Shell Station on Main Street, the Shaw Food Store on Moody Street, and the River Street Food Market twice, targeting single female clerks each time. Still at large, he fits the following description. He's five foot four, white male, average to thin build. Uh, each time he was wearing a hooded sweatshirt and a ski mask. To prevent another robbery and to prevent crime in general, police have reached out to local businesses. We've increased patrols. Every officer in their sector has made it a point to stop by all the stores to see who's working. We actually had, an, once again, informational flyers that we gave out to every single business, as many as we, we could get out there, including in the newspaper and everything else, to have everyone be aware. We've tried to, you know, tell them to step up their cameras, you know, some of the camera systems out there are older and stuff. The newer ones will help us better identify the suspect. Police are grateful for the citizen help, but discourage anybody from pursuing suspects. We don't suggest uh, chasing down someone. 911 calls are the best way to notify police of anything out of the ordinary, although Chief LaCroix said that calls made from local landlines are quicker than 911 calls made from cell phones. When you dial 911 from your cell phone, it goes, does, to the state. it goes to the state. So there is a little bit of a lag time before mm -hmm. it goes to the Waltham 911 center. So okay. people need to be aware of that it's not a fatal problem, but it, it is a little bit of a, a slowdown in the. But if uh, they have a phone there, a regular phone, reg landline. Regular hardline phone, you dial 911. We're going to direct. It goes, goes directly, directly to the 911 center. For Waltham News Watch, this is Chris Wangler.